Hey guys, John Luxley here, back with our blind playthrough of Fran Bow. So I'm a little bit not nervous about this next part, but I'm uh I don't know. We so what we need is the hair, right? Hair from the person you want to be witch. I don't know how we're gonna get that. That's why I don't. I don't know, let's try the matches with uh, bad recipe. I can't do that. Okay. Combine baking powder with bad recipe. Thing's not working, makes me angry. I don't know what the baking, well it says baking powder and then on the box it says baking soda. Okay. I uh, I'll lay down and sleep tight when I get back home. Aunt Grace has for sure put some new sheets. Love the feeling of my sleepy head on a clean pillow. Me too. Not sure what to do with this. Hello, doll. Right, so... I looked all over, and I didn't find any hair. Room to take me up. My reflection not there. Yeah, I don't know. Lock the attic, but how? I don't know. Okay, we can't do that. I don't know, I'm kind of trying everything at this point, because I don't... Right, that's not a shock. We're stuck in the well. Brock died, it's not good to eat bottles. She is correct. So as far as I know, the only point of going in here was the bottle. I mean, I don't, I don't suppose I could take the rope. No. I take the plank? No, it doesn't appear so. Well, alright then. So that does nothing. Yep. Protect the kitty. Burning candles. Many tiny paintings, and there is a cat. When I grow up, I will have lots of cat paintings on my walls. Typewriter, and it works. I guess I could write. Oh! I'm a genius. Aha! Totally matches the font and everything. Oh, what should I do? I refuse to do this. It can't be a good thing. Okay. So that... Um, I mean, I don't think we can use the good one with it.
No. I need it just as it is. Right, so... I mean, that's everything, right? Ah, uh, okay. Brand, here are the materials you'll need. Have you studied the ritual? Yes, but I'll need more time. I can't remember all the words. Well, learn them fast. Let us know when you're ready. Uh, psst, girl, I think you need help getting rid of this bag. I can do that for you. Right, because there's some twisted stuff in there. But I may need it. No, you don't. Trust me. If we want to get out of here, this bag must disappear. I'll take it. You didn't see me. Bye. Okay. Right, let's take a look at what... The heart of a frog. The head of a young virgin. Hair and blood from a black cat. Pentagram made of ashes, which... I don't know. Oh, I guess that's in the room. And But you have to cook it inside. And the burnt body of a fox. Okay, we'll talk to the toad again. Did you find a solution already? I don't know what to do. I'm mentally stuck. I'm, I'm not really, but... I know you have something to see things that makes you see other things that other people don't know. I'm a talking toad. You can talk to me. Never thought of it, but you are right. Seeing everything, maybe you're missing some messages. Bye, Toad. Okay. Well, let's... Do we talk to her? We are waiting for you, friend. She's not happy about that. Let's use this on her. Tampered bad recipe with twins. Look, ladies, there's something missing. I couldn't find your hair in the bag. Hair, you say? There's no hair needed. We know that. But look for yourself. It's written down there in the recipe. That's true. How could we miss that? All right. There. Now get prepared. I'll let you know when I'm ready. Dark hair from the twin's head. Alright, so we have pentagram of ashes, all that stuff. The world has the truth from you. Work your soul through life and you will understand the purpose of this act. If you try to corrupt this essence, your soul will be hidden and never see the face of truth. To destroy an impure soul or give freedom to those who are trapped, you will need... Blood from the executor of the ritual. Five black candles, ashes to form a pentagram, a blue-bloomed moonlight rose, salt and pepper, air from the person you want to bewitch. Draw a pentagram with the ashes inside the black and white square. Put a lighted black candle on every point of the pentagram. Fill a cauldron with water and put the other elements in it. Boil. Pour over the person you want to bewitch and repeat these words while you walk around the pentagram. And then, uh... I really hope I'm not expected to memorize that. Use hair from the twins with the boiling water. Now the hair, good. Uh, okay, I should show the girls that the potion's ready. Made the most incredible magic potion in the world. So do I talk to them or let's try talking to them and then I'll pour it on them. Everything is ready. Let's go to the kitchen. Good. Let's go. She seems scared. I would be too. After all, this is kind of... Okay. Please sit down and close your eyes, ladies. Okay. Use potion with twins. 
There you go. And now I'll say the words. Bonde ir ekran or begma o ibure nam ibure ir bonte ir ekran. Begma haf memon dime gof mia ibure ek twis ik nemi bomeg ibrem isne. Wait a sec, that is not the right spell. You tricked us. Oh, it's the right spell. I see. Well, all that black stuff was the evil. What have I done? Oh my goodness, this is not right. Uh, don't worry about it. The key, now I can free my dear kitty. I'm nervous. A golden key. I wonder if this will open the cage. But now I have to get my kitty back. What have I done? Never thought this would kill them. I'm sorry, girls. You know, you're right. It didn't specifically say that it would kill them. But, well, it's okay. Question is, is the attic open? Come on, Fran. Please get me out of this cage. Find the key. Don't worry, I have the key. Twins key with golden cage. What is it, Fran? Open the cage. I can't. The key doesn't fit. Did you see another keyhole somewhere? Uh, yes, yes I did. I'll see if it fits. I'll be waiting, hurry up. In the mirror. I was trying to think about it, I was like, what? Where was it? I won't even try that. Well. <coughs> hmm. Block. Key was for this keyhole, and what's that? A puzzle? Well, alright. Um. Okay. I guess I have to open this thing, but how? This must be part of the machine. I can't move it. So, is this like a sliding block puzzle? I would. Ah, uh, got it. Okay, so what do I do with this. A mechanical thing. It rotates. It may be some sort of engine. Right. Oh. Right. I have to move all the gears. Okay. That makes sense. So... I wonder if it's below it, like I need to use this one. Oh, this one can't be moved. Hmm. Okay, well, we'll try these. Oh, that's interesting. Honestly, I kind of expected it to just start working. Hmm. Okay, so we have five that we can move. That's so probably one, two, three, four, five. Open this thing, but how? This can't be moved. This is part of the machine. I can't move it. Okay. Um. So that looks like it's too... That might work. It might be this one as well. So let's try that.
Okay, well, yeah, first let's get that one down there. Okay, so that one's not going to go there. That one, that one might go there. So this one might go there, except no. This one could go here. sliding block puzzles. Hmm. Okay, so that's the reset. Mechanical thing, it rotates. Problem is, I just don't like the gears don't snap into place, so I don't know what will work specifically. See, we'll change that in a minute. All right, so I don't think no. Hmm. I mean, I suppose this one could go there, but that might work. Hmm. Or perhaps not. Like, these two can't be next to each other, I assume. Right? Try a regular one right there. See, I wish they would spin so you would know they were in the right place. Like, that doesn't look like it's in the right spot, but I don't know for certain because it's not. Let's reset it real fast.
See, maybe that's right. I don't know. I mean, I can't tell. It's... And I don't have a gear or anything, right? Mirror, why is my reflection not there? I don't know. I feel like that might be important, but it might not be. Well, we'll just try, uh... See, I want to. I want to believe this thing has a purpose. So that won't reach. So I feel like maybe this has to go here, because it won't reach anywhere else. So those look like they fit. But there's nothing that goes in there. Maybe some sort of engine. I have to open this thing, but how? One can't be moved. Most part of the machine, I can't move it. That's interesting, isn't it? I mean, I mean, you have to connect these, right? Hmm. 
So you don't feel like either of those fit, but I don't know. Let's try resetting it. Doesn't look like any of them fit. Well, maybe this one. Maybe not. I don't know, it's hard to tell. and thinking that this needs to get moved. Maybe this is the wrong spot. Okay, I mean that... No, that doesn't look right. Okay, that's a start. Okay. Okay, finally we're making progress. Okay, so then these three have to go in there like that. Okay, kinda glad that worked. then presumably this is going to go right there. Or here. Okay. Okay. All right. So we have the skeletons of the twins, presumably. You okay, Fran? What is this? Two skeletons. They're kind of small, like me. So I was really thinking with that puzzle that this, the things weren't going to turn. I was really worried about that. I'm glad I had that little feedback element. That way, you know, you know you're doing it right. Okay, so the skeletons are really small like me. I can imagine who these two were. Then I'm not a killer. Two skeletons. They're kind of small like me. What's this stuff up top? Lots of stuff. Oh, hey. Okay, so we'll go over this stuff one thing at a time. Sister promise, we, Clara and Mia Bahalmet, promise to revenge... <clears throat> promise to revenge the unfair destiny, destiny itward decided for us. With blood and tears, we promise that we will kill him and bring our bodies back. We won't stand this any longer. Even though we are sisters, we hate each other and we will always hate each other. Nothing will ever change that. But now, with our bodies attached to each other, we can't complete our task. The strongest will live forever and the weakest will die. Hmm, let me see this. Who's Itward? Eh, these girls are very strange. I wonder why they hate each other so much. 
picture, Mother Must Die. Mother Must Die, ew. Maybe that mommy wasn't a good mommy at all. My mommy was very good. She hugged me many times. That's important. Oh dear, this must be the key to the cage. Finally. We have pearls. Pearls, I guess, from a broken ne necklace. Duotine. Um, except this is probably the actual duotine, not the fake duotine that she's taken. Duotine. My pills are called duotine, too. Right, because remember, we had the... There was the uh, the red bottle with the label all scratched off and a bottle of duotine with yellow pills in it. And, yeah. Hmm, but they got the yellow ones. I wonder what's the difference. Pink rosette. Pretty hair decorations. Decoration. That's a blue rosette. I like it very much. Shiny stuff. It looks like a necklace. Right. We promised to revenge the unfair destiny it were decided for. So that was interesting because in the description of the game, uh, with uh, something about strange powers and an unfair destiny. Oh, two-headed doll. It must be a really old doll. And the, I think that's the Gemini symbol. I haven't actually looked... It's also quite dirty, I guess, because they played a lot with it. My toys are also a bit dirty. I miss playing with my dollhouse. Alright, well, let's... The strongest will live forever and the weak will die. That's weird, right? So I guess they were trying to summon Itward. Okay. Cat. Go on, Fran. Please get me out of this cage. Find the key. I think we have it this time. A silver key. This must open the cage. I think this is the key. Yeah! It worked, my dear kitty. It worked. Come out. Let me hug you. Oh. Oh, she's crying a little bit. That's good. I'm glad you finally found Mr. Midnight. Oh, this feels so good. I'm free. Fran, my good friend. So get out of here. If it said let's get out of here, I would select this one. But this makes me think that, like, you're in danger. You should escape. I mean, he is in danger. The monster said the cat was marked. You're free, my dear. Now it's time to go home. Yes, let's go. Find Mr. Midnight. Achieve it unlocked. Let's talk to the cat. We need to get home, kitty. I hope the way back home isn't far away. I hope so too, Fran. We can do this together. I can help you. Alright, let's roll. Okay, so the cat is with us. Uh, monster, don't appear. Monster who likes goats. Goat looks angry. I guess he's ticklish or annoyed. No, but... Oh, the cat's playing with the rug. It's this one, right? That one? And the skeleton? It's that monster and so much blood. I guess we're not the only one who can see him then. Maybe the... Maybe... I don't think that's it word, but it could be. Because she... I don't know. Okay, so I think it... The stairs end up in a wall. Right, how do we get out of here now? I mean, we could go to the well. Actually, that's a question. Take the pills, does the cat end up back with us? No. The cat does not. Okay. I mean, I guess we could try this way. Let's talk to the toad. I did it, Sir Toad. The girls are gone. 
That is perfect. Now I can leave this place and go to my family. I want to do that too, sir. I finally found my kitty. I just want to go home now and be with Aunt Grace. But how will, how will you get out of here? There is no boat. Um, can you help us? I thought you could help us get out of here. I would love to help you, but I'm too tiny. Even though my body is quite moldable, it would be impossible to carry you both to the other side. Let me think about it. Don't leave us yet, please. Uh, baking soda, maybe? Soft dough, bigger and beautiful. Take this, Toad. It may help. Not a bakery bun, but you're all slimy and soft, like dough. You're right. It may work. Here it goes. Oh. It worked. It really did. I'm so big, and I feel gorgeous. Great. Let's go. Come, Mr. Midnight. Sure, friend. I only have one complaint. That giant toad is staring at me. Oh, don't eat the cat, please. What are you talking about? He wants to help us. That's all. All right. If he tries anything, I will scratch him. All right. Sounds good. That's okay. But try not to hurt him so much while we're sitting on him. The water is deep, and we don't know what kind of creatures are in there. If we fall in the water, we could die, kitty. Oh, I promise I won't scratch the toad. Let's go. Hey, girl, before we go, I forgot to give you something. I saw you in this picture, so I thought it was yours. Oh! And this book was with it, too. Leon. Oh, Toad, you found my family photo. Thank you very much. Thought I had lost it forever, but the book is not mine. Oh, well, take the book as a gift. It's always healthy to read. It has many pictures. Wow, thank you. I like pictures. Well, let's go now. Yes, here we go. Hold on tight. Okay. Oh, really? Uh, Frogger? Presumably we control it with the uh, the mouse. Also, I love the texture. Look at this. It's like clay. Oh, that's... Uh... See, I tried to click because I want to go sideways, but... Come on. There we go. I'll skip that one. I'll just keep going. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Boom. This is kind of neat. Okay, we want to wait for one. Like that. Come on, another one right here. Come on. Oh, and there's the cat. It's Fran and the cat. Ah, uh, that didn't work. Thought it would have worked. But, you know, whatever. Also, the music's kind of nice. It's a nice little mini game. Oh, this is... Can I go down? No. That didn't work out. Right, we might need to wait, because there's two on this top row. Uh, well. Okay, that, yep, that's no good. Is there only one, is that the lily pad? That lily pad the only one on this row? I guess we'll find out. Uh, yeah, looks like it. Okay. Well then, we'll see if we can get the flower that didn't work
Oh, there you go. Toad on board. Baby on board. Here we are. Jump off him now. Let's go, kitty. Well, now it's time to go home. I hope you find your family soon, Sir Toad. Thank you. You too. Farewell. Goodbye, sir, and thank you for the ride. Fran, what should we do now? Find the way back home, kitty. Do you see the sky? It's dawn, and really soon all the scary things will disappear. Ah, uh, I'm so hungry and sleepy. I want to go home now. Me too, kitty. We'll find the way. I'll do my best to help you, my dear. Let's go. Let's check out the flowers. Beautiful flowers. Crystalline water. You are so pretty. Could you tell me the way back home to the flowers? I guess they won't talk to me. Hmm. wonder if someday I will learn how to swim. Maybe I can ask Aunt Grace how to teach me. Or just to teach me. Okay. I'm not thrilled with the music. Are you a stone? It'd be grand to see a troll. Well, let's, uh... Should I try the pills, or should I just go forward? I have a feeling something bad is gonna happen, so let's try the pills. Oh. Okay. Yeah, that's... that's no good. Oh dear, a baby skeleton. I guess they didn't make it in time. Good night and sweet dreams. Oh, it's just, if you click on both, it's just the, the baby. Okay. Let's, let's move forward. Yeah, this looks totally safe. Oh dear, this bridge looks pretty scary. Oh, Fran, come on, we have to go home. There's no time to be afraid now. Yes, but I'm a bit afraid of heights. Um, I can go first, all right, then you follow me. All right, kitty, you're so sweet. I'll be right behind you. Careful. Okay, um, do I, do I go? Wow, what a tree. It has many roots. They look like arms. I would love to have a conversation with the tree someday. All right. Okay. That wasn't good. That wasn't a good sound. Be careful. Come on, friend. Let's go. I'm waiting for you. Oh. Fran, wait. Oh, there it is. And she's bleeding from the eyes. Oh my dear, I can't hold it anymore. I don't want to die. You won't die, my friend. Come on, you can do it. Jump. All right, here I go. I got you. Oh. Fran, no. Don't be afraid, Fran. We always fall. And after the pain, we will always rise. Oh dear Aunt Grace, don't ever leave me. Don't cry, my little girl. Your heart is pure, but your mind is tormented. You have to stay and walk your own path. Please, Aunt Grace, why don't you just take me out of here? Please. You'll just leave me all alone, like my mother and father did. I'm sorry. My dear friend, you will soon understand. 
Oh, Grace, no. Don't go. Please. Please. And she's crying blood. Oh, and there's Dr. Dearn. Bran, it's time for your new medicine. Okay. Oh, we're the cat now. Look, because I have a cat paw instead of a hand. So there's this uh, Fran's dress and Fran's tights and boots. Oh, what happened? Where am I, Fran? Where are you? This is interesting. What a strange shape. What is it? I hear sounds coming from it. They speak. It may be a city. Oh. Ah, what an ugly tree. I scratch you, evil thing. Kitty? Kitty, stop it. What are you talking about? Bran? My darling, is that you? It can't be. What is it, my dear? Of course it's me. Who else would I be? Friend, you are a tree. Don't be silly. Help me get up. Wait just a second. Where are my hands? Why can't I move? I'm telling you, my dear. You've become a tree. What? But how? Oh, my dear. This was the end of the line. The big monster did this. I know it, Kitty. He won't let us go home. I hope he won't come back. He was very scary. He always comes back. I think I remember him from that night. That night Mom and Dad died. Kitty, I don't want to talk about it. I just want to go home. But you are a tree, my friend. A tree. I can't carry you all the way back home. Besides, I'm not sure where we are either. Am I going to die, Kitty? Tell me. Please don't say that, Fran. Don't leave me. But I feel so weak. Umka igni mihala. Koke koke igrunma. Aska halani. Igni jokle vanti. Okay. Ah, be careful, sir. Why are you attacking me? Could you please tell me where I am, sir? Hello, koka. Hala. Stop it. I'll scratch you. Hello, wrong my igni. What are they saying? Oh, my kitty, why is this happening to us? Hola. Stop attacking me, please. I mean no harm. Hola, ig, niventi. Kitty, help me. Find my purse, please. Maybe I can do something about this. See what I can do, Fran. Fran's shoe. Stop attacking my friend, Carrot. Can't really understand what you're saying. Did you find the purse already? I think this creature wants to kill me. Where's the purse? I have no idea, but do you remember my mother's purse? Well, that one. I'll find it, my dear. I'll be right back. Okay, so we can go that way. These are friends' stockings. This is a wooden boat. An old vegetable sitting on a boat. Okay, there's the purse. I see my friend's purse. I have to reach it somehow. I refuse to expose my beautiful and soft fur to water. Okay. Well, let's try this thing. All right, that works. I've seen similar mechanisms. They circulate. Okay, one way. Oh, wait, what? Okay, that doesn't make any sense. Circulates. Circulates. 
So as soon as I step on the thing, it goes. So I don't know. Maybe I put a boot in it or something. Oh dear, I hope you found the purse already. I found the purse, but I can't reach it. Why not? Oh dear, do something. There's a bridge and lots of water, and the bridge won't work as needed. Ah, oh, that's just perfect. Well, make it work. I can't really help you from here. There's some round things that keep on rolling back. Well, do something so they won't roll on back then. And Kitty, I love you. Thank you for helping me. You're the best. Rand's shoe. Okay, I can't do anything with the shoe. Oh dear, I hope you found the purse already. I'll keep searching. Friends, stockings. Stockings. Shoe. I guess she needs her shoe back. I don't think I can go to the city. Things sitting on a boat. Oh, what's this? Oh, I'll take the stone. It's shiny. I've seen similar mechanisms. They circulate. Use crystal with cogs. There we go. Genius. I got the purse only because I'm the best. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, okay. Picture's pretty. I was a little kitten then. This is a mysterious book. I can't read it. Can I use bloody knife with walking vegetable. It won't work. Okay, let's talk to Fran. Fran, my darling, I got the purse. That's amazing. You're the best, Mr. Midnight. Now show the sir who is attacking me my family picture. Maybe he understands what human is. Well, I really hope he does. Okay. The bow family picture with walking vegetable. Wanam, Nihaka, ah, Runma, Haskin, Oltu. Uh, that didn't work. Huh, where are you taking me, Sir Vegetable? They want to help you, Fran, I can feel it. Wicca, Runma, Ippo, don't be afraid, my friend. Kitty, stop them, please. Don't leave me. I'll be right here with you. Galopma, Galopma. Okay, I, uh, vegetative state, that's hilarious. I don't, I don't really have any words though, you know? Okay, so the carrot is bowing to a, another carrot maybe? And then uh, Fran is planted in a pot right there, okay. Itman Bal Menokist Be Zyre Nihala Wanam Ershmo Iptem Gorska Emitan Ulfriel Gorska Zyre O Okay Welcome creature Oh Welcome, creature. My name is Zyre. Do you speak human? Oh my goodness, yes. Finally, words I understand. My good friend Ride told me that you showed him an illustration with four humans and a cat. I assume you are one of them. The little girl. Please forgive my good friend if he scared you. We have never seen a human looking like a tree before. Oh, okay. Am I... Okay, I'm Fran again. Yes, let me explain it to you. Oh, ho, ho, no need to speak, my child. The seed will show me everything. Ectomonokist ecto, ecto bro, ecto prote. Oh. Hmm, let me see. You are good, no doubt about that. A seeker of the truth. Very common of the bow family tree. 
Interesting. I don't know. I mean, so family tree could be a pun, obviously, but... Bow. Okay. I mean, you know... Ah, your name is Fran. You are the girl with the passion for life. I see great love towards this little creature standing next to you. A cat. Protector of gates. Interesting. Can you see all that in the seed? Be quiet. I see something else. The seed doesn't hide anything. I see a world nobody should see. Nobody except for one. Who's the one? What do you mean by except for one? You mean the monster? You are not supposed to be here, friend. That is the only thing I can tell you, my child. I understand, but can you help me then? We can't let you leave now. It's too dangerous for us. You should never have been aware of our existence. There must be a way. Am I dead or something? And I just realized this must be the city. Because we see the, the white stuff? Dead? What do you mean by that? You know, when you no longer exist. Besides, it's not normal to be a tree. I must be dead. Death, things, death is nothing more than the absence of love. Hmm. Once you can't feel love, you die, even if your body still walks. Then I'm not dead. You have to help me get back home. Little cat, come closer. Let me see you. What is your name? My name is Mr. Midnight. That is indeed a very pretty name. Do you think Fran should go back home? Yes, I do, sir. Show us the way back home, I implore you. Ah, I have a question. Are you the king? Haha, uh -huh, you are hilarious. Yes, I'm the king. The king of Ethersta. Oh, what an honor, your highness. By the way, I like your leaves. They're pretty. I don't think he's a strawberry, but there's strawberries right there. King, sir, please, will you help me? Why is this need of you going home so great? The seed told me your story. You don't have much to go back to. There are many reasons, sir, but the most important is my aunt. She'll protect me. I want to feel that somebody cares about me. I feel confused almost all the time, and I want to be someplace where I feel at home, sir. I see. You are very brave. So did he not see Aunt Grace in the seed? I just want to go home. Please help me. There are things I cannot do, but I will help you. I will lead you to the door that will take you home. But it's your own task to walk through it. Really? Oh, thank you so much. And where's this door, sir? We'll talk about that later. First things first, you must be able to talk and walk on this land. Yes, sir, that would be very great. I'm afraid I won't be able to bring your human body back. Only the great wizard can do that. But we'll talk more about him after the procedure. You must first understand our language. But how will I ever understand your language? Eat this fruit. Uh, that was weird. So he spit into her mouth? Weird. Your ears and tongue will be able to understand, but not your eyes. That means you won't be able to read. Don't worry about that, I can always ask. Excuse me, do you understand what I say, human lady? Yes, I do, and you sound so kind. This is incredible. Did you understand my kitty? Oh, did you understand, my kitty? I didn't, your highness. I demand one fruit for myself. You don't need the fruit, Mr. Midnight. Our land is based on fragrances and sound. You'll see everything as your own world very soon. Oh, that's creepy. No doubt about that. You'll do fine, kitty. And sir, do you know why I became a tree? Yes, but I don't think it's the right one to give you the answers. Now, it's time for the procedure. Are you afraid of heights? A little, yes. I get dizzy. Why? Take her upstairs immediately. Where are you taking me? What are you going to do to me? To get some arms and legs. Everything will be fine. I'll be waiting for you, Fran. I love you. I'm sure it'll be fine. 
This won't be horrible. Uh. Good day. My name is Polontrust, and I'm your doctor today, at your humble service. Are you the emergency case? Wow, amazing. What a huge, beautiful, fluffy thing. Excuse me? Oh, I'm sorry. It's just that I've never seen anything like you before. I'm still trying to understand that all of this is real. My name is Fran. I'm a human girl. The king sent me here to get some arms and legs so I can go home. Oh, a human. I think we can get you a pair of arms and legs. We'll have to travel a little bit further in order to fix that. Are you ready to enter the paws of the beast? What beast? Me. I'm the beast. Let's go. Here we are. Wow, this place is so beautiful and peaceful. I wish I could be here forever. Which is silly, because she just said she wanted to go home. Thank you, this is my home. This is where I was born. The spirit of the great Velokas created it. It has the purest water in the whole universe. Oh wow, that sounds amazing. Uh, let's ask about the great Velokas first. Who is the great Velokas? Haven't you heard about the five realities? He is the king of the first reality. A long time ago, he was at war with the darkness, and one day he fell. He fell so badly, his heart was broken, he was all alone. But he came to Ithirsta, and his blood made this water pink. That is why it's so pure. It's a very long story. Wow, that sounds grand. I mean, I didn't know about other realities. And how is it that you're here? What brought you to Ithirsta? My kitty and I were on our way back home. I was so happy to see him and hug him again, but then we fell. The big monster that follows me did this. He broke the bridge. He wants me dead. Who would like to see you dead? That sounds terrible. I prefer not to talk about this. But, Sir Doctor, do you know why I became a tree? Yes. Sometimes our wishes are so strong that they become true. You did this in order to keep yourself alive. Think about it this way. Your human body was destroyed, but you wanted to keep being Fran. You wanted to keep your life. So you took on this empty shell to maintain all of your precious memories with you. It's actually the first time I've seen a human using a tree as a chrysalis. But it's dangerous to have you here. It makes our land vulnerable. I did this, I did this to myself? Wow. But, Polontra, sir. How? I didn't know I was doing anything. You really didn't know what you were doing? I see. Well... When you traveled to Ithirsta, you opened a door between your reality and ours. And with this door open, unexpected creatures can also enter our reality. And if that happens, the balance will be tainted. Okay, so when she fell, she died. And there's only one who would like to poison the second reality. The monster, the terrible black. I can't see this happening again. I just can't. So it happened to the first reality, I suppose. Oh. Don't be sad, Doctor. I'm very sorry for what I did. I didn't mean to. Oh, little girl, you're so nice, and you don't have anything to be sorry for. I think you're very special, but let's concentrate on your arms and legs, alright? Hmm. Yes, Doctor. Soldier of the sun, spirit of the water, give Fran her arms and legs. How do you feel, Fran, from Athirsta? Wow, I feel like a beautiful tree. I have leaves. Glad you like it. I told you we would fix it. This water is magical. It can fix anything. Anything? You think it could fix my mommy and daddy? What do you mean, fix them? What's wrong with them? Nothing, doctor. Thank you very much for helping me. You're the best doctor I've ever had, and you are fluffy and beautiful. I had another dog before. His name was Dr. Dearn, but he was an evil old man. Old man. Hmm. I bet he wasn't that bad. Maybe he was just following the rules. I wonder if there's a relationship between Dr. Dearn and the Terrible Black. And... Uh, let's go now. I'll leave you at the station. The Terrible Black and... Uh, was it Ingward? 
are not, uh, or not inward. Itward. Or it must not be the same thing. There they go. Here we are again. Show Zyre the king what a nice Ithersthenes you've become. Thank you again, Doctor. You have to meet my kitty someday. That will be lovely. I'll see you soon. Goodbye. So we're here, and we no longer have the pills or the purse. Okay, well. We'll stop here today. Uh, I gotta be honest, that was a turn that I did not see coming. Vegetative state. Yep. Two more chapters to go. All right. Well, uh, so seriously, guys, thank you for your time. Thank you for your attention. I really do hope you guys enjoy these episodes. Um, that's that's it for today. Um, I hope to see you guys next time. Until then, take care, guys.